Hi there and Assalamualaikum. I like to share a fantastic animated effects in Canva. In the previous videos you have seen, I've shared with you some animated slides that Canva have as templates. At the same time, you can also use these animated features. So I'm going to show you how you can do that. Let's go on to the next slide here. Okay, so just head to elements and then look for blob. Let me just look at blob and see whether it will return any these are blobs which are very very nice organic shapes that you can use for your presentation for your um, media any social media and so on let's go for liquid blob effects you can see these are animated yeah. and just want to show you two ways to do this and uh, to make your particular presentation um, for example a cover slide or even the summary slide as well captivating the way i see it these are the two points which are quite important in your presentation the start and also the end so let's have a look uh, at the effects that see we're looking for it let's have a look at what they offer here okay let's go for this click on that one and then you can head to the text section you can choose the text here heading and so on or you can even choose the template text i'm going to speed up the video and you can see how i just add a template here okay so this is one way to use an animated effects this liquid blob effects in in canva I like to have my coffee as double espresso. So for this, let's just have a look at this one. So this blob, let's close this. I'm going to double it. So copy and paste. And what I do next is to make it slightly bigger. To create an effect. Shift it a bit. And I'm going to position it at the back of the first blob okay change the transparency a little bit to maybe about 69 let's see this can you see that it creates a really nice effects uh, at at the back there you can always if you want you can always make it slightly bigger okay And what you can do next is, you can see this handle, you rotate it a little bit. I will just change a little bit more the transparencies, maybe about 50. Okay. And that's how you can get that two effects you see it in my slide here. The next question is that how can you use this particular slide in your PowerPoint? Yeah, as your cover slide, for example. So just head to um, this down arrow where it says by default it will download as a video. And you choose, in this case, let me see, this is page 18. You can just scroll down and choose the page that you want to download. Yeah. So click on that, for example, click done, and then you can press download. 
to download that. I have already done that earlier. So I'm going to head to my PowerPoint. In my PowerPoint, I just had to insert. I go to videos, video from file. Head to desktop where I keep that video earlier downloaded. I press insert. So the video is here to check it's working or not. Just press play. And there it is. Click pause or stop. And now what you can do if you want, this is your cover slide. You need to go just click on that video again. This menu will pop up. It says video format or playback. You click on playback. Okay. And start automatically. Click on loop until stop. Click on rewind after playing. So that you can have a continuous loop. Go on and on and on as you are about to start your, your particular presentation. And you do the rest of your slides. And then you click play or display. And there you go. So this is how you can use Canva with PowerPoint. Incorporating your video from the slide that you design in Canva into PowerPoint and use it, especially in the beginning and at the end of your presentation. I hope from this video, you have gotten some creative sparks for your next presentation. Thanks for watching. I see you in my next online class or tutorial.